win it. This is the second finals that I've gotten into after the 2017 World Cup. So, yeah, I'm a little disappointed. Do you think the team struggled to deal with the nerves of the big occasion today? I don't think so. I mean, uh, once you are onto the field, you just zone out. So I don't think we felt nerves as much, no. In terms of the fielding, did you feel that you struggled to set the tone in the field for the, for the bowling performance? Yeah, initially, I mean, if you give chances to people, uh, to batters who are in form, I mean, they are going to utilize those chances. And if you, I mean, anything, it could have gone either way. Uh, but the chances we dropped probably costed us. But then, yeah. It's just not the fielding. I mean, we could have been better in all the three departments. Yeah, in terms of the bowling effort, obviously Alyssa Healy was in amazing form. She hit you for several sixes. So just tell me as a bowler what it's like to have a batter of that quality coming at you so hard. Uh, you, you do have plans against a batter like her, but then the kind of shots that she played were amazing. And sometimes you can just stand and, you know, uh, acknowledge and kind of appreciate the shots that she's playing. So it was one of those days when uh, I was at the receiving end. Yeah, obviously, in terms of the tournament as a whole, it's a very young team, isn't it? One of the youngest in the tournament. So how positive is that to know that there's a group there to take forward? Uh, the good thing is that we're just 60. I mean, the youngsters, I mean, it's a team which ranges from 16 to 30 and the average age is 23. So, I mean, a lot of them have so many years to, you know, learn and get back and play good cricket. So, uh, we, I mean, we're just hoping that get everything, all the departments can just get better from here. 86,000 people in this stadium. Obviously, you didn't get the right result, but how special a night was this for everyone involved? Uh, firstly, I mean, uh, it's it's. I would say it's a global. Uh, uh, the record that was set today of 86,000 people coming and watching a standalone women game. We had Billie Jean King come in. We had Katy Perry perform. I mean, it's it's huge just to meet them in person. So uh, it was. I, I'm. I would say that I was privileged to be present here to be part of this uh, event. But then, yeah, just. It's just uh, disappointing that uh, to be on the uh, wrong end of the match today.